So the question is, do, does the 17% healthcare cost savings from GLP-1s offset their higher price? So average annual healthcare cost for a patient with diabetes not on GLP-1s, is about $14,000 a year. Average annual savings for those who are on GLP-1s is about $2,400 a year. When I was reading this, my question was, is that the cost to the patient or the cost to the plan? And that $2,400 savings is to both. It's to the plan cost, the overall claims on the plan, whether the member is paying a portion of that or the employer, those numbers are not separated here. When somebody takes GLP-1s, they are going to see a savings of about 17% lower medical costs. Okay, so they're gonna get $2,400 savings. So even though they're spending $10,000 a year, they're gonna save $2,400 a year somewhere else. Metric, annual cost for non-GLP-1 diabetes care, $14,000. 17% savings for GLP users, $2,400. Annual cost of Ozempic, $8,000, $12,000. Net cost difference, the average healthcare savings per member, $2,400, is much less than the annual cost of Ozempic. Here it's saying $12,000, but in the other statistics, they were showing $8,000 to 